Well, hello and welcome to Words of the Day for October 14th, day 23. You ready? Here we go. We're going to do random dictionary word. Yesterday we got that, uh, um, what was it? A uh, language uh, chart. Let's see what we get today. Oh. <laughs> of course, I get another chart of all the words in here. I get one based on the currencies of the world, like the different money. And I actually, oh, oh wait, it was dollar. It was uh, the Belize dollar. Wow, okay, you gotta see this. So these are all the different types of money throughout the world. There's a lot. I'll read a few. We have the Afghani, the dinar, the dollar, the peso, the franc, the um, escudo, the uh, peso, the kuna, the euro, the delaski, the mark, the rupee, all kinds of good stuff. Okay, words of the day. Here we go. First word of the day is judge. Okay, not judge the noun. Okay, if I were to use judge as a noun, it'd be like, don't judge my drawing. Okay, um, but we're gonna, sorry, if I was gonna use judge as a verb, I would say, don't judge me or don't judge my drawing. But we're gonna use it as a noun, um, and it comes from Latin, and it means an official authorized to decide questions before a court. Okay, so this is like a judge in a courtroom. Um, my sentence is going to be, the, uh, the judge decided the fate of the criminal. Okay, second word of the day, formulate. Okay, formulate. Uh, it's a verb, it comes from medieval Latin, and it means to prepare according to instructions, okay? So oftentimes you're gonna hear this one used um, in a sentence like, um, they formulated a plan to rescue um, the prince, okay? Formulate. Third word of the day, control. This is a noun uh, and it comes from late Middle English and it means power to direct or determine, okay? So this is like, uh, um, I have control of the classroom, okay? Um, yeah, that works. You can also use it as a verb. Um, you'll see it as a verb a lot as well, um, but we're using this as a noun, okay? I have control of the classroom. It sound, almost sounds like it's a verb, but it's not because have is what, and then control is what I have. So here we go, spelling words, fourth graders. First spelling word is the number 20, okay, 20. Uh, second fourth grade spelling word is products, uh, like I go to the store and buy some uh, products. Um, and the third word is happened, okay, it happened to me. Fifth graders, you ready? First word is climbed, climbed, I climbed a mountain. Second word is wrote wrote, like I wrote something down. And the third word is, is youth, okay? Youth. Uh, sixth graders, you ready? Here we go. Cooperation, okay, cooperation. It's something I wish people would do more often. Uh, second word is creature, okay, creature. And the third word is dangerous, dangerous, okay. A lot of different ways you can share this with me. Um, choose your favorite and send it my way. Thanks.